Hey, I'm Josh Ackman in the customer service department at Park Industries. And today we're going to be talking about photo eye tripped alarms. Um, so that'll pertain to Savers, Voyagers, uh, newer Titans, the Titan 3000 series, um, and multiple other machines here. So if you ever have an, an alarm where it is photo eye tripped, we first want to start by coming to our photo eye here. And we are on the operator side right now, and this is the, um, the receiver photo eye. So first thing to do would be clean both photo eyes on each end with a rag. And you can use some rubbing alcohol if you'd like, if they're really dirty. But make sure they're clean and there's no other obstructions in the way. Second thing we want to look for is, like I mentioned, we are on the receiver side. So the green light here is the power light, so we know we have power to it. The amber colored light is the signal light. So if I block that signal, then it goes out. We want to make sure we have this signal light on. That's what will get rid of our alarm. If you do not have the signal light on and your photo eyes are clean, then um, clean and there's no other obstructions, what we can do is come down to the transmitter side here and we come on this side here I'm just going to take a black piece of styrofoam and you can see that red dot there. Now what I want to do is just walk that red dot across, walk that red dot across and make sure it lines up. It's going to be very hard to see with this on camera here, but I want to make sure that, that the receiver side here on the operator side is centered of that red dot. If it is not centered, there are four um, socket head bolts underneath here that we can adjust and move our photo eye. Maybe our photo eye got bumped or something. And then also, if you need more adjustment than what's in there, what we can do is adjust here. And we can loosen these bolts. We might need to come up or down with our arm. Um, Maybe possibly somebody pushed on the arm a little bit. Um, somebody leaned up a slab up against it or something like that that put pressure on that arm and uh, got our photo eyes on a line there. So that uh, once you have that amber colored light on on the receiver side, you should be able to clear your alarm and start running again. If you have any questions, let us know and uh, just give us a call at the customer service line and that is how to align your photo eyes and clear your photo eyes alarm. Thank you.